Hey everybody! Today I'll be talking about movie review number 140. And this movie is called The Crime. The Crime is a 2020 movie directed by Michael Andrew Corfino. Corfino. And actually, he stars in the movie as Mike. One of the two main characters. Um, the other main character is Kyle. This is a Sony Pictures Crassus and Top Studios movie. I saw this movie on November 20th, 2020 at AMC Westchester 18 in Westchester, Ohio. Loved it. So this is about two best friends named Mike and Kyle. Whose relationship takes a tour when Mike, when it is discovered that Mike is was in a was in a relationship with Kyle's fiance, as far as Kyle's fiance had relations with him and Mike, and when Mike told Kyle that out that the relationship just takes a tour and then some years later they see each other then and they both have been different but this is a movie about a toxic relationship between two best friends and how they may not have best intentions, but they are still friends for a reason, even if the relationship is toxic. This was a good movie in my opinion. It definitely talks about how a friendship can be toxic like these two guys. Yes, like I said, Mike tells Kyle that he has had relations with Kyle's fiance at the beginning of the movie. And it's also depicted in the trailer as well, so that I'm not revealing any spoilers. But this details the ups and downs of the relationship and how a few years later they're trying to maybe like put the relationship back up again. In other words, the crime. I guess that means, in my opinion, the relationship as far as has been a crime up and down. There was bumps in the road, and they're trying to fix the relationship with one another as best friends. So that is a good movie, and they did a good job on it. Like I said, it's a Sony Pictures Crisis movie. Wow. Well. Go check this out, guys. Even though it's an independent film, I still encourage people to see it, although it is rated R. And I won't go into much specifics of that, but it is all weird, so just be aware of that. But it is in a while, Sonic Pictures Crash's movies are all weird, so that doesn't really surprise me. Anyway, that's my movie review of The Crime. Please stay tuned for my next movie review. Alright, goodbye.